We know that length multiplied by width gives us the area of a rectangle. We can use algebra tiles and the area of a rectangle when working with expressions. Sometimes expressions contain a bracket that we want to expand. Let's see how algebra tiles can be used to represent this. Let's look at the expression 2 multiplied by 3x plus 1. This is a product with two factors, 2 and 3x add 1. It can be represented as a rectangle. The 2 becomes one dimension of the rectangle. The 3x add 1 becomes the other dimension. We can use the tiles to represent the area. We need x tiles and 1 tiles to complete the rectangle as these tiles have dimensions 1 and x and 1 and 1. Using the tiles to represent the area of the rectangle gives the product 6x add 2. When finding a product where both factors include algebraic terms like 2x multiplied by 3x add 1, the x squared tiles are also used. Sometimes the x tiles are placed vertically in the completed rectangle and sometimes they are placed horizontally. Labelling the dimensions of the rectangle with the factors helps to determine the orientation of the tiles. So, let's recap how we can use algebra tiles to represent expanding brackets. Watch these videos to learn more about how to use algebra tiles in Key Stage 3 mathematics.